Welcome back. This tutorial will discuss taking NVIDIA GeForce 7300 512MB video card and installing it on a Dell Inspiron 531 desktop with the integrated 6100 video card. First thing you do is make sure your complete power is off, not even plugged up. You take this side off and locate your graphics slot which on mine is the PCI Express which is in the color black here sorry for the quality but you see the two PCI slots is the black one right above the PCI slots that's your graphics slot now all you have to do is just take your graphics card make sure you are holding the side of the desktop so you have no static or at least be in contact. Now all you have to do is just slide the graphics card in gently. Make sure you don't break anything or mess up any of the little slides in it. What you saw was just the whole damn fallout. Which that's just held in by a Phillips head screw. And you screw that back in place. After that's secured, then you put the cover back on. Now, if you notice at the beginning of this tutorial, I showed you uh, the one of the adapters that's for the video card to where you can hook up two of the regular, forgot the actual term for them, for dual monitors. And I will make a tutorial on that later how you can run two monitors on this video card. So you just match it up and you screw it in as a small flathead screwdriver. You make that completely as tight as you can without over tightening. Do not cross thread them. But you want it snug to where it doesn't have any free play in it. And when everything's back together, you will hook everything back up like you didn't add the video card which means your monitor will be plugged up to the integrated card which is about to be shown right here now you start it up then you go to start control panel device manager since I installed this video card and made this tutorial it had to find the integrated one which as you see is a G4 6100 technically 6150 but what you want to do is just go click run this is the CD that's included with the video card normally they're plug and play but I like to be safe double click the drive scroll down and you see all the run this pops up automatically but since I already had a disk in I brought it up and you just click install video drivers wait a little bit then you restart now when it comes up to the BIOS menu it gives you F2, F12 hit F2 to bring up your setup you have to be fast then you go to advanced hit enter scroll down to integrated hit enter scroll down to onboard NVIDIA LAN hit enter use the arrow button go up disable it F10 and choose yes by hitting enter now you restart your computer this is where you connect your monitor to the video card. You do that before it even turns fully back on and it will pick it up as you see it's a plug and play. That's what PMP means. And you adjust your settings to whatever you want. Here I'm just messing around with some. Then you go to advanced settings. Click monitor.
adjust the settings a little more. Advanced settings, click monitor. 60 hertz, let's make that 75 hertz. That's your refresh rate. Higher the better. And here's just going through, making sure everything's right. Okay, okay. Then you hit X. Okay. It's done. And I would like to thank you guys for this tutorial. So, I am just, yep. Right now, I'm just checking. Make sure. You always want to make sure that it takes it. Right here, I'm double checking. Yes, it's plug and play, but I'm still updating it. As you see, I don't have to. Well, that's.